that was most interesting to me was just that as an acting role, it was really challenging. It's definitely the kind of part I couldn't have played, certainly not when I was starting out, maybe not even 10 years ago. It's the kind of role that, you know, for me as an actor, and there are all kinds of different actors and some of them can do incredible things, that like for me, I have to be able to connect to some life experience to bring that to bear in the role. And so the more life experience I've had, the more ups and more downs, particularly from challenges, from pain, from, you know, comes growth. And, uh, and I learned more things about myself, and so I thought, you know, I had more to bring to bear performance-wise. And I was interested in doing dramas about real people that, yes, presented challenges and difficulties in realistic ways, but also were inspiring and suggested that, you know, life can get better, because it absolutely can. And, uh, you know, so I, I saw this mainly as like a real acting test for me, and it ended up being something kind of more and became a movie that's actually quite meaningfully meaningful to me personally uh, as well. I don't know where anyone would be without second chances. I think you judge people by their successes, not by their failures. We can all fail. Um, but, you know, it takes a lot to uh, face something that's really difficult and really scary and really hard, whatever that is in your life, and to get past it, experience it, understand it's not going to destroy you, that you can grow from it, learn those lessons, apply that to your life going forward, and uh, continue to get better. And, and you know, I think uh, the themes of redemption and second chance, and I'm a guy who's needed, you know, I feel like 27,432 chances. But uh, it's, it's, it's one of the most graceful and beautiful things we can do as people is to kind of embrace our own flaws, the flaws of others, accept that, uh, and, and, and try to see people who genuinely want to get better and help them. I think this movie is deeply inspirational because it's not hokey, it's not preachy, it's not like a, a lecture. I don't, I don't want to see that, I don't want to do that. But it is a story about like uh, somebody who's gone through pain, some pain I can understand, some I, I have no idea. I, I can't imagine what this, what it would be, have been like for to go through that. Um, but that, you know, it's kind of like Good Will Hunting. Like how do you re-engage in life after suffering? How do you decide like to live according to your values? How do you get past things that are really hard? And that I think is really, um, important and, and valuable and, and, and meaningful to me.